How's it going, guys? David Dumphy here with Healthy Finance, a place where we talk about health, motivation, and of course, financial freedom. Today, we have some big news on Amazon and why we're starting to see this go into a bullish sentiment. If you like what you see, stick around. So at the time of recording, price of Amazon is now $93.41. And we are seeing that there is a major drop over from its all-time high to almost 49% drop. And that can be a bitter pill to swallow for a lot of people that especially started investing late on, like myself, who started investing in November 2021 really heavily. And then just seeing that in the decline for the past year, it's just been a major drop. And it is a very bitter pill to swallow. And I totally get it. I totally understand people that are out there, you know, like me, working a nine to five job and, you know, trying to invest, trying to you know, create a future and seeing prices like this. But if you look at the bigger picture, if you see the overall sentiment that's going on right now, we are seeing more of a bullish signs happening with the company and some of the news is on amazon planning to invest one billion dollars a year in movies and theaters and although i feel like this shouldn't be that big of news the fact of the matter is amazon is consistently trying to grow even when the economy is trying to shrink and now they're trying to invest $1 billion into movies right now. And I think that is incredible. I think that's a new sign that Amazon wants to just branch out further than what they already are. Um, being one of the biggest um, online realtors is incredible. Their e-commerce is amazing. And the fact that they are now not only doing streaming, music, um, <laughs> They have Alexa technology is just going further. They also are moving into the movie business. And that's just one step further for this company to grow. And just uh, just to keep like in mind why this is so important. $1 billion right now into movies, 12 to 15 movies a year, is on par with Paramount Pictures. And they want to grow over time as well. So they're definitely going to be looking into more production, more movies. And this opens up more avenues for producers to find other companies to shoot their movies. And especially indie films or anything like that, they want to see if they can get into the big films. Amazon might be a way to go as they too are starting to move in and they're going to be trying to get bigger names as well to join their movies. And I guarantee you when they're first starting off, they're going to be looking for some big heavy hitter movies to really push them forward and show that they can compete with the big dogs. So to see this right now, to see all this information, we can see why there's going to be some more bullish. I mean, the fact that AMC is also growing and trying to be a huge company and people are going for that. The fact that Amazon sees that as well and feels like this could be an opportunity for them to grow. It's really good. And I really think that they are going to go further. So I know this is just a small video, quick little clip on Amazon. <laughs> I'm really just testing out the new products and seeing how this works. It's been a while since I posted on Healthy Finance, and I've been streaming um, YouTube videos on David Edward Martin Dunphy channel. So I've been streaming a lot of like video games and stuff on there. So if you want to check out that channel, that's where I've been kind of like focusing my attention right now because I'm still trying to figure out this whole streaming stuff. But I did want to do a small video for you guys just to show you what's up and what's going on. And as you can see over there in the corner right there, you can see my book is out Amazon on Amazon as well. So <laughs> we got that. And not only that, but let me just show you this. We also now have Keepers of the Lighthouse. So if you guys are interested in psychological horrors, they are both on Amazon. So that's why I'm supporting Amazon so much right now because Kindle Direct Publishing has been giving me the opportunity to get my books out the way that I want them and how I want them wrote. And it's just been awesome and I've been selling copies of this and I've been selling copies of Winter's Eve and it's just a great way to get into it. Uh, if you guys are writers or at all, um, definitely check out the Kindle Direct Publishing owned by Amazon and all their wonderful products that they've been using to sell and make books. And this is what I've been doing. So if you guys are interested at all, um, check out the book. I'll leave a description down below. I'll also leave it in the comment section. 
And I would also like to do a giveaway for Keepers of the Lighthouse. So if you are at all interested at all, just leave a comment down below and maybe we can do a competition for that soon. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. This is David Dumphy with Healthy Finance, and I'll see you guys in the next video.